Hi everyone. Every graphic designer often requires stock photos for their projects. Here are the five popular websites that offer free stock images, along with information about their licensing. The first website is pexels.com. Most of the time, I use this website to download free stock images for my projects. You can search for your required photo from here. This will give you a lot of results. Here is the download button. License detail, free to use for personal and commercial purposes. Attribution is not required, but crediting the photographer is encouraged. You cannot sell the photos without modification. Next move to the second one which is, unsplash.com. This is another excellent website for free stock images. Click here to download the image. To search your required image, click here. License detail, all photos can be downloaded and used for free, both commercial and non-commercial purposes. Attribution is not required but appreciated. Do not sell the photos without significant modification. Move to the third website which is, pixabay.com. Here is the download button. You can also make edits if you have Canva connected. To search your required image, click and type here. License detail, free to use for commercial and non-commercial purposes. No attribution is required. However, you cannot sell the images as they are or imply endorsement by the original creator. Now let's head to the next website which is, Burst, by Shopify. You can search your image from here. To download the image, click here. License, Creative Commons CC0. Details, free to use for personal and commercial projects without attribution. No copyright issues. However, redistribution is not permitted. Move to the fifth website which is, freepick.com. Freepick offers a variety of resources, including vectors, stock photos, and PSD files. To search your required image, click here. Have an option to filter our search. License, free pick license. Details, free images can be used for personal and commercial projects with attribution required. Premium content is available for subscribers without attribution requirements. Always check the individual licensing for each image, as specific requirements may vary. And that's it. Share your thoughts on this. If there is any question, you can ask in the comment section.
make sure you head over to my YouTube channel, where I upload graphic related tutorials. Thank you for watching.